Hello human and welcome back to my channel. So, how are your days going? Ugh, sorry, how are your days doing? I'm sorry I stutter a lot and I hate it. So, today, as you can see on my video right now, we are currently doing the line art and coloring, which is the finishing process after sketching the animation for my trailer of the you know, my project, animation project of Among Us Project Sapphire Blue is actually episodic animation. But if you're interested, you can watch them in the future because I'm not finished yet. I'm currently doing this trailer right now, as you can see on your screen right now. But hey, anyway, I have a little surprise for all of you. Also, I'm currently kind of using my voice acting voice a little bit. That's why I doesn't sound like my own original real voice. But anyway, I will do voice acting of me, narrating the whole entire trailer. Hopefully you are prepared to hear this spoiler. But if you're not prepared, proceed to, you know, skip this part until you don't hear me voice acting the narration, okay? Alright, let's get started. I'm gonna read in 3, 2, 1. Long ago, far amongst the stars, there was a round sphere planet with purple earth covered with white cold dust called snow. We called it Polis. Despite its harsh condition, there live its inhabitants which you all know them as imposter. They were a peaceful kind despite their appearances. They used their capability to survive in the world that was rough and difficult to some other life forms. Their nails are used to pierce its prey and break down the earth to make home. Their sharp teeth and tongue are for eating foods that are as hard as diamond. One day, another life form called human made its visit to the world of the inhabitants. They welcomed the human and coexisted peacefully. However, some humans have turned to their greeds and result in a horrible deed. They kidnap some of its inhabitants to conduct an experiment to create a vaccine for their kind to survive on planet Earth. Earth was once lush and green. There are always lands everywhere. But their previous horrible deeds have caused their own world a big price to pay. North and South Poles both have melted their long crystallized water, causing the earth to be covered in the oceans of blue. Despite their past mistakes, they have yet to learn that they mustn't have taken for what wasn't their own. From the kind they have taken advantage of, they created a new life form which is called Project Sapphire Blue. It was half of their own kind and half of another. With the life form that they have brought upon the world, they created the so-called vaccine, which caused the Greeks to use it for wrong, thinking that the Polis inhabitants need to be exterminated for its dangerous features. <sighs> oh my god, I need to breathe for a second. Hold on, Whew. I'll continue. <sighs> upon the discovery of the Polis inhabitants, they decided to act. Soon, a genocidal massacre occurred. Some remains to fight, some started to escape, while some others evacuate. Due to the circumstances, the human abandoned their needs to fix their important facilities which erupted into a catastrophic explosion on the planet, turning the world that was once round into a crescent moon shape. Countless has lost its life to the tragedy. While well, some remain survived, holding on to the grudge of losing their loved ones to the dark history. Okay, that's pretty much how this story read. Maybe at the beginning, I'm gonna add a little bit of spice. You know, like before I start the story on the long ago, far amongst the star part. Maybe I'll add the voice acting of a woman saying, Oh, hello there. Are you new here? I see. Interesting. Well then, um, before you start any of your tasks, would you like to listen to a little bit of story about Polist past? Well then, alright, I'll be sure to tell you the story. 
And then the story starts and she told Long ago, far amongst the stars And the, you know <laughs> I'm kinda a little excited <laughs> Sorry, I'm just kinda getting a little excited on the story part I just love narrating I love doing voice acting but I never really get a chance to be a voice actor But I'm trying my luck on the casting call club website where um, most voice actors try their luck over there most voice actors they even have the free one and the paid one it's up to you to choose which one if you're lucky you got selected but if you're not lucky then you didn't get selected of course <sighs> oh my god voice acting is tiring you ha- I have to be honest I'm literally losing my breath <sighs> sorry that you have to hear me taking in some breath and something like that Okay. <sighs> also, I have some news for you guys. Next week, I have an interview with an animation company for my internship. Wish me luck because I don't have any other internship place left. Oh my goodness gracious. I am terribly... I, I have to be honest, I'm actually pretty nervous. What if I messed up? I don't want to mess up. I really don't have any other place anymore. And hopefully, if I do get you know my internship over there everyone there is actually chill chill and it's not toxic and something like that because that's my most concern that's the most thing that i concern about because i'm the type of person who might get bullied pretty much pretty much also if i accidentally blow into my mic i'm terribly sorry for giving you ear rape and also there's another thing that i want to talk about which is I made reaction video on Alan Becker's animation. It was very good. The animation, I really love the animation. But just to let you know a little bit special thing, which I did put my face reaction there. But not to get your hopes high, I wear mouth mask, meaning only my eyes is visible, so you can't really see my face. I don't know, I, I still am camera shy and I don't really feel comfortable showing my face. As you can see, when I do the reaction video, I literally don't look that... It, it's not that I don't look that comfortable, I feel awkward reacting myself. And I have to be honest, when I watch my own reaction video over there, my first reaction video that I recently sent, you have no idea how much I want to slam my face into a wall feeling so much embarrassment. It was so embarrassing. Embarrassing. I can't. <laughs> I can't. It's so embarrassing. Like, I felt so cringe. I wanted to, you know, die <laughs> from cringeness. <sighs> oh, God. <laughs> for some reason, I felt like I want to delete that video. But for some reason, you guys seem to be enjoying it. Like, the, the view on that video is slightly more than other video that I posted and there's more like on that video than other video which makes me think that okay maybe you guys do actually enjoy this <laughs> but hey if you do let me know that down in the comment section below and also for the random art weekend it's still going on right now the deadline is on this Sunday so if you didn't make requests yet can go ahead make requests on that post still it's the end of this video now so, I want to let you guys know that thank you for watching my video until the end. Some people probably already skipped by now, but you guys are very nice to stay until the end of my video. Still, if it would be more nice of you, proceed to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my vi- my YouTube channel. Not uh, Video is the same too, but uh, <laughs> you get the idea. Um, still. But I'm not gonna force you to do it, okay? Because some people probably felt like, eh, she's telling me to do that, I don't feel like doing it anymore. You know, like, you wanna do the dishes and then your mom came in and say, hey, do the dishes, and then your mood just got turned down. Yes, that's exactly what I feel. So I'm feeling like you guys might feel like that too when I start to mention stuff, but from what I watched from another YouTubers telling me how to grow my YouTube channel, they said to do that at the end of the video. So I guess I'm gonna be doing that now. Hope you guys don't feel annoyed by it, okay? Still, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys again in the next video. Bye. And also, stay tuned. And I hope you enjoy my voice acting.